Hey guys, it's Stan Beck again over at the Hinzo Gracie Jiu-Jitsu Academy of Weston. And this is Albert Behar, he's going to be helping me out today. Uh, we're going to do an armbar escape. This armbar escape I love. Uh, Mario Delgado of Hinzo Gracie, Mexico, taught it to me. I think it's fantastic because when you're on your back and someone's attacking an armbar, if they're really heavy or very strong, you know what a pain it is to get out of it. And this one does not matter how strong it is or heavy. It's very easy to get out of this armbar. Okay, let's go. So, we're here, the guy's on top of me. He set up his attack for an armbar. Now, for the sake of argument, just so I can talk a little better, I'm just going to take his leg off my head here, okay? So, he's attacking the arm, I've got my arm hugged, I'm defending well, he's starting to pull. Now look what I'm going to do. Either on my own, I'm going to switch to a gable grip, or maybe the guy was pulling so hard, I lost my grip and I get to here. Once I'm here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring, turn towards his feet and I bring my elbow inside. With my elbow, I shove his leg into my half guard. Now I've opened up his legs. Now there's a big space. So I, I'm going to turn back into him. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to punch him in the chest with the back of my hand. But as I do so, I'm going to do it like this. Okay? Like I'm waving. I don't want to do it like this, straight in the arm because he can still finish me. I'm going to turn. Hit him in the chest with the back of my hand and just pull my elbow up to the floor and I'm sitting. Now he's got no control. It's really easy for me to get on top and pass. One more time. Alright. So the guy has my arm, I'm defending. I switch to the gable grip, I get my elbow inside, I turn to the leg, I use my elbow, I put the leg in my half belt. There. He doesn't have the same control anymore. Now I turn into him, and I'm going to just simply hit him in the back, in the back of my hand into his chest, and get my elbow right to the floor. Boom. I've opened up the guard so much, it's easy to put, I mean the leg so much, it's easy to put the elbow to the floor. I get on top, and I pass. One more time. If the guy happens to cross his feet, cross his feet, it's a little harder to get in here. What you can do is, you let go of the heel grip and grab your feet. Now, you're going to use your hand to open it up enough to get the half guard. Turn into him. Again, hit him with the back of the hand and the chest. Pull the elbow to the floor. You're safe. And just get on top. Okay? Alright, guys. So remember, defend the arm. If none of these escapes are working, just switch to your gable grip or go there on your own. Or maybe the guy's pulling so hard, you end up in a gable grip or a ten finger grip. Turn to the feet, elbow inside, pushing the leg into your half guard. Turn back into the mat, and just like this, hit him in the chest, and your elbow's going to go right to the floor. You've opened up tons of room, and just simply go on top.